They're off and pacing Swift Chance left well for the lead. On the outside, Chase Tomorrow drives up. Further out are Gilboy and on the far outside, Recognize Left, and now backs off to look for a spot. Chase Tomorrow going comfortably up top now by a length and a half. Gilboy looks to drop in second in front of Swift Chance, third. Racing in fourth, Sackham in fifth position, Mudges Chad racing sixth, Milson recognized now the trailer off a quarter in 28 and 3. By the grandstands for the first time, Chase Tomorrow in control, racing second, Gilboy in third, a swift chance towards the inside, fourth, Sackham out looking for cover, fifth, here comes Mudges Chad. Then on the outside, Milson moves up sixth and recognized trail seven lanes from the leader. They race to the half mile. Chase Tomorrow has everything his own way. He leads a length and a quarter. Gilboy tucked in second. Now Swift Chances brushed out of third. Moving up on the outside. Fourth comes Mudges Chad. 59 and four and they're halfway home. A leisurely 31 and one second quarter. They'll pick up the pace for the final half. Chase Tomorrow leads ahead on the outside. Hanging second, Swift Chance. Gilboy towards the inside. Third on the outside. Mudges Chad fourth. Holding the inside, fifth is Sackle Milson out there, followed by Recognized. And around the far turn, off stride, Mudges Chad. Mudges Chad is off stride. Three quarters, 127 and two. Third quarter and 27 and three. Around the turn, they're in the stretch, and Chase Tomorrow leads a length and a half. Trying to come on again, second is Swift Chance. Gilboy is third, and Chase Tomorrow is drawn away by four. Towards the inside, Gilboy racing second, a late move by Sackham. Chase Tomorrow easily in front, racing second, Gilboy, Sackham is third. In Balmoral's seventh race, five, Chase Tomorrow is your unofficial winner, six. Gilboy finished second, two second was third and one swift chance fourth. Your unofficial perfecta five six. Please hold all tickets. Let's go to Maywood. Ladies and gentlemen, we are seven minutes away from this, the seventh race here at Maywood, the start of the late daily double. Field of eight, no changes. Perfecta wagering on this race. There's seven minutes to post. Tonight's seventh race is official. Going into the winner's circle, five, Chase Tomorrow. Chase Tomorrow is owned by the Cura Racing Stables, Evergreen Park, Illinois, trained by Bob Farrington, driven by Brent Holland. Chase Tomorrow, a track program selection by Kathy Clocker. Tonight's seventh race was the Silver Snail Birthday Race. Seventh race is official, five, six, perfecta, $17.20, 17 20 on the five, six, perfecta. Rundown top down is four, three, seven. Scratch one, two, six, five, 156 flat for the mile. In the eighth race, no driver changes or scratches. Correct claiming price on three. First Society, $10,000. Perfected trifecta wagering on the eighth post time in 18 minutes at 10.32. Now it's back to Maywood. Ladies and gentlemen, horses are on the track for this, the seventh race, the start of the late nearly double. This is the clearance is rendezvous and Patrick's post party. Perfect the wagering on this race, field of eight. No changes, just five minutes 